As you know, a fusion of technologies characterizes the industrial renaissance. It blurs the lines between the physical and the digital domains. Today, we are going to take a deep dive into the manufacturing twin. This manufacturing twin is a virtual representation of your manufacturing assets, of your real manufacturing assets. The production line on the stage is a real one. It is connected with real PLCs, controllers, and manufacturing execution system, such as our Delmia Appraiser. First, we will show you what is a virtual twin. Then, we will show you how we created it. And of course, we will highlight what we can expect from a manufacturing twin in terms of feedback and experiences. Here are some of the values and benefits brought by the 3D Experience platform. We are going to focus on how the modeling of your products and best practices can help you to address your key challenges. In order to reduce cost and time by digitizing existing facilities and reuse best practices. In order to increase flexibility by mastering a large number of product and variants and in order to increase efficiency by optimizing your manufacturing assets. Today, there is no more business transformation without a digital transformation. Let's see together how the 3D Experience platform enables your digital transformation. On that screen, you can see a virtual representation of your digital twin. Thanks to the integrated point of cloud technology, you are able to navigate inside your virtual twin. As you walk around, you will get near some points of interest. For each of those points of interest, we are able to display KPIs of the real production line. You also see actual data from the production line, such as the work orders or the overall efficiency, equipment efficiency, called also OEE. So think as it of a looking class for your manufacturing assets anywhere around the world. Let's take a look about what is displayed in real. So for instance, you can see that the work instructions are displayed on that screen. It means that you can see what are the instructions given to the operator on the real line. The time it takes to virtually model a factory could be long. Changes might occur before you finish that work. However, digitizing your factory will help you to secure your future investment before physically transforming your assets. Thanks to the 3D laser scan technology, you can insert new equipment such as robots, racks or whatever you need in order to test a new configuration. Let us show you next how Dassault System and our partner Navis can provide you with a manufacturing twin in a very short time. In the next part of the demonstration, we will show you how fast you can build your, the manufacturing twin. For the past many years, industries have using 2D layout footprints in order to capture their manufacturing assets. Now, time is changing and 2D layouts are limited. This is why Dassault System is always looking for new partnership with companies promoting emergent technologies. In this example, this is the 3D scan technologies and we are looking for a partnership with Navis. It is a German company. Navis provides specialized tools that are used to efficiently capture 3D point clouds of, of indoor facilities. For example, we are using a trolley called M3 and this trolley is able to capture 25,000 square meters in less than eight hours. The room we are in, in has been captured by this trolley and it took less than two hours for the company. Think of it as a Google Street View. The Navis M3 is able to capture the real world in 360 degree and also in high resolution point cloud. So on the screen here, you can see that we are in the 3D point cloud inside the 3D experience platform. And we are using Exalid one part to analyze the point of cloud and to replace this point of cloud with a standard equipment taken from 
a library of standard components. This way, we will replace the point of clause by standard equipment and we will enable you to quickly change and reorganize your manufacturing assets. With the association of the latest 3D laser scan technology, you have seen a very powerful tool to digitize efficiently existing manufacturing facilities. What is the next step in the digital continuity paradigm? So, for the process planner, every story begins with a product. This product is also called an engineering bit of material. It is a very complex item because it stores all the information regarding variance and configuration of your product. As a process planner, you will have to break down this e-bomb into several manufacturing assemblies. And you will create what we call the M-bomb, the manufacturing bill of material. Reorganizing the e-bomb into an M-bomb requires you to make decisions on what to outsource, what to fabricate, and what to assemble in-house. You need to answer all the technical constraints that will lead you to ensure the feasibility of the success of the process. Next, you are going to transform the M-bomb into process plans, making sure that the flow created respects the characteristic of the product. As you enrich each step of each operation, you are going to create work instructions. Those work instructions are going to be used by the operator on the shop floor. It will give him the right information at the right moment to fully understand and respect the process. Another key benefit of the digital continuity is that design engineering and manufacturing engineering are able to work concurrently. The direct connection between the definition of the process and the execution of that process will enable you to manage a large introduction of products and variants. To fully validate the process plans, we are going to run some simulations. We are able to run those simulations into an organizational context. This example shows a flow simulation. As you can see, this flow simulation occurs in the 3D Explains platform, reusing all the steps that you prepared earlier. As unpredictability is part of real life, this kind of simulation integrates random events such as failures or non-conformance. You can use the flow simulation to analyze the utilization rate of such assets. Will the result be different if you slightly change any input? Imagine the difficulty and the cost of doing what-if scenario in the real world. Using the 3D experience platform, you are able to do those what-if scenario and relaunch the, si the simulation. Let's take an example of the tray. The tray is a key input because it is working in a closed loop and it will uh, say you are not able to launch a work order without a new tray. So using this kind of simulation, we were able to validate that for this specific production line, we needed to use eight trays. Understanding the complexity of your manufacturing assets is another benefit of the manufacturing train. We at Dassault System believe that human is the center of the process. So that I will introduce Quentin on the scene and he's going to talk about the new application about ergonomics. So I'm going to present you the new application which is called Ergonomic Workplace Design. So this application allows you to simulate and validate the ergonomic of your worker task. So with this application, a worker task has never been as easy. With the application, you can easily... The ergonomic workplace design contains two new patent innovations. The first one is the smart posturing engine technology, which automatically allows you to place the mannequin. So uh, it ensures that the mannequin is no, has no interference with the environment that it has a proper end grasp and that it is in equilibrium. The second innovation is the ergo forward technology, which automatically provides an ergonomic assessment of the mannequin posture. And with this ergonomic assessment, it analyzes what needs to be changed inside your environment. So to create a, a safer 
environment for your worker. You just have to follow the recommendation given by the application. For this example, it's saying that it has, the drill has to be closer to the body. So by putting it down, it's going to show you that the new posture are perfect for the worker and there is no risk for the workers to do the task. Okay guys, so now we are on the last step of the demonstration. This is the virtual training. We talked about, about engineering and now let's focus about how we can improve the work of the operator. So, with the virtual training, you can gra gradually teach the operator using a typical show me, help me and let me teaching scaffold methodology. Also, you can train your employees before any physical product exists and without stopping the line or investing in an expensive training dojo. The operator will understand the know-how of the process before that the process really exists. The right end has a short ray. Hey Quentin, can you show me your right end? Yep, this one. So the one that you are using to grab the parts and using the 3D model. But on the left end, you got also uh, a kind of help button. Can you show me your help button, Quentin? Yeah, this one. So what is happening when you don't know how to, how to do? Yes, you can use this kind of help in order to highlight what is the next step. And the operator is, is, is in investigating the process. And thanks to this lifelike experience, the operator can practice without any risk of injury, non-conformance, and incorrect, incorrectly operating the machine. The virtual training reuses work instructions that you have defined in previous steps. In case of any difficulty, the virtual assistant is here to guide the operator. Using the virtual training, operator understands the know-how of the process, increasing first-time quality. So, as a conclusion, we have seen together how the real world and the virtual world can be merged into one world, thanks to the 3D Experience platform. You are now aware of the capabilities of the platform to simulate and validate next changes in your factory to secure your investment. You have seen how you can reduce cost and time by digitizing existing facilities and reuse best practices, and how to increase flexibility by mastering a large number of products and variants. How to increase efficiency by optimizing your manufacturing assets. Those are the benefits of the 3D Experience Manufacturing Twin. Thank you guys. So the 3D Experience Ergonomic Workplace provides relevant and useful ergonomic guidance to non ergonomists enabling you to take quick and efficient decision to reach your manufacturing goals.